All right. So, working on my uh, fire tank here. Want to kind of show y'all um, the basic uh, requirements for fire tanking. The important things, of course, health, restoration, and dominance. Uh, of course, um, looking at my mods, I generally spec in my yellows restoration and health, both beneficial to the fire tank. Um, I go blues, dom health, and some fire. I also get the might based DOT. In my reds, I go uh, might dom. Power points. All right, my power point allocation since I'm a fire tank self heals. So here it is. We have our heals over time. Um, got some uh, more heals here. Basically, a lot of self healing. Iconics go for your hit of heal criticals, the extra dom, and the health. All right, now for uh, your movements, always get your counters down here at the bottom. It just helps you being able to break out of stuff a lot easier. A little control resistance. Fire tanking again is a healing based fire tank or healing tanking power, so spec your resto, your dom and health. Um, again, kind of going through these trees. I won't go through all of them, but you really want to get your healing stuff, so like your magnifiers for healing and all the resto you can get. Of course, dominance, health. But uh, the magnifiers and the crits for healing are important. So go ahead and go over my loadout real quick um, for new content you really want to run a heavy heal loadout is what I call it till you're done grinding and then you could kind of loosen it up a little this one here has quite a few hills in it but works out pretty good you notice the only pull I have is backdraft uh, when I need to I switch out that grappling line uh, wildfire is what I usually keep in there to help spread uh, you can also use another one to spread dots, which would be your meteor. Um, that works fairly well. But uh, in this uh, video, I'm kind of going over everything, but really going to address what everybody complains about the most. Tank pools. Alright, going to go ahead and uh, warp on over to the lead call and show you all some pools. Most people uh, say that's probably the tank's biggest thing. Everything I see in the forums is tanks, uh, fire tanks can't pull. I think fire can pull just as well as any other tank. You just need experience and uh, knowing how to do it. Um, a couple techniques I'm going to show you here. We'll go over. So let's get down here and take a look at it right quick. All right, we just moved our base, our league hall here. We uh, decided to go under the sea. I'll show you that view some other time, though. Another video. All right. Guess I could uh, probably just edit through this so you don't have to see me run through the, the old league hall. But for those of y'all that haven't seen it, this is the under the sea look. A little different layout <clears throat> all right so pools here we go said I uh, choose to use uh, a grappling line for macrobats I also choose that uh, when I use it to use it while I'm in the air line of sight can be blocked so if your other group mates are in your way and you're trying to pull an ad that's behind them you won't be very successful so by going in the air, you kind of catapult them over whoever's in your way. So I do that quite a bit. Also backdraft. Backdraft works a little different versus uh, when you're on the ground like this and when you're in the air. When you're in the air, it gives you a uh, better pull and you notice how everybody just kind of swung under me. Uh, once you get really good at it, that uh, that pool right there can be capable of handling whatever you need in the game. 
Um, like I said, I use this grappling line when I need to specialize in pulling specific targets. And that's another reason why I prefer the grappling line versus low pressure is I can pull which one I want. So, key thing is being observant. What's going on if uh, someone's hitting your healer, you need to grab that person and get them away from your healer. Same thing for the troll and anybody else, but you need to be paying attention to what's going on. As a tank, you got a lot going on and when you hit it, your aggro and your holding block take a moment to kind of pan around and see what's happening um, fire is a great tank for uh, juggling and that's how a lot of them kind of uh, stay alive when you juggle a target while they're up in there you can hit yourself heals and keep her going just a little demonstration on uh, backdraft and the area of pool get a little closer Just a little closer. There we go. Piece of cake. Throw them a good ways behind you. Well, that's it on the the pulling. I'm going to uh, cut out of this and then go into some feed and show y'all some loadouts that I run with in higher content. Show you how I change up uh, grappling line with different things. But everything else is uh, pretty much what you need for staying alive. All right, enjoy the videos, guys. We'll talk to you later. All right, so here is some uh, solo T6. I went ahead and just pulled all three of these guys out. Figured it'd be some good damage on me and kind of show you how these self heals work. Do love what they did in game update 43. The heals are even better. I didn't really have a hard time before as a fire tank. I mean, I've just learned to deal with it and keep myself uh, healing and you know adapt. But these heals, man, are fabulous. Uh, if your CR is over 81, you're gonna get an increase to your resto. Um, pretty good chunk. So these heals even are more beautiful. But this is the healing run. Um, basically all three basic kill alright guys uh, this is an alert T6 alert here I'm going against uh, all these ads you notice that I just have backdraft in um, I'm rolling around lighting <clears throat> everything on fire I'm hitting block because that'll aggro them over and I alternate and move around um, the playing field try not to get my comrades compromised but um, it's pretty much it when they huddle you too hard you're gonna need to push them away like that and get up in the air and backdraft just kinda maneuver your way and flame is also a juggle get them off of you um, so you can cast your other powers as well so this is pretty much it it's keeping crowd control and uh, utilizing backdraft if you can pull ads where you want to in this part you're pretty much have it down man um, just go ahead and show you some other stuff well guys uh, this is about it um, hope you all enjoyed the video uh, if y'all liked it like it if not sorry I <laughs> uh, hope to have a couple more for y'all just showing some different variations like I said this is basically just a a healing loadout fire is fantastic love the juggles and the self heals it's a, it's a fun power um, kinda play around with it guys like I said uh, once you get the gear you can go around and have just a good time with your powers thank you much guys